Hi, I'm Eric Mays. I'm a Joico guest artist, and today I'm here with Sophie Alkis. Hi, Sophie. And we're going to show you um, four easy ways to incorporate scarves into your summer wardrobe. Um, and the four looks we're going to show are one for travel, one for a barbecue, one for the beach, and one for a pool party. So let's get started. Headband is really great for travel just because uh, what it does is it keeps the hair in place and it makes uh, getting ready for travel effortless, I guess, right? So um, with something like this is really simple. It's got a simple knot kind of in the front so it's ready to go. And I'm just going to kind of place it down over the top of Sophie's head. And again, like I said, the, the whole key with uh, hair and incorporating scarves is that it looks more organic and more fresh. So there you can see is a very simple way to incorporate a headband for travel. Our next look is for if Sophie were to be going to a barbecue. If I want something that's a little bit more organic or undone, I have to put some type of texture and a little bit of you know, grip into her hair. And first, I'm gonna start with our Instant Refresh. So I'm just gonna take sections of Sophie's hair. I'm just gonna spray it directly into the root area. So um, by sectioning this top half up and out of the way, it's just gonna make it easier for me to be able to put the scarf in place and then to you know, be able to work with this section kind of uh, when I'm finished with that, with that part. And I'm gonna take the scarf, keeping in mind kind of the, the part that I really wanna show, and I'm gonna place it just kind of on the top here, kind of behind the front hairline. And basically just tie it in a slip knot in the back here. With this here, I'm going to then just tie it in a bigger, bow here because I want to create some fullness in through the back here. So now I'm just taking the ends of that section through the crown and I'm wrapping it around the bow that I created with the scarf. And that is your finished look. So our next look, we're going to go to the beach. We added some texture to Sophie's very straight hair. And the reason why is just because I wanted it to have a little bit more uh, movement to it. So I've taken this square scarf, it's rather large, and I folded it in half. So it basically made a triangle. And I'm gonna take the center of the straight side and I'm gonna place it just in the center of Sophie's forehead here. Just make sure that when I look at it, that it sits just kind of before the round of her head or before her head starts to slope up. That's gonna ensure that the scarf is gonna stay in place. I'm gonna take the two ends and just tie it through once and tighten it so it's comfortable. So Sophie, will that work for you? Is that comfortable? Great. So I'm gonna then do one more slip knot just to make sure that it is secure. That's the look for the beach. So now it's time to get Sophie ready for a pool party. The great thing about this look is that it really just incorporates doing a simple braid and then wrapping a scarf around the base of the braid. So I'm gonna use a little bit of our Design Works hairspray by Joico. Spray it from afar, just put a little bit on. And just put it in a low ponytail. So now what I wanna do is basically create a three-strand braid, but I'm gonna use a small section of the left side of the braid to go in with that side of the scarf and a small section of the braid on the right side and then the largest portion of the natural hair in the center, okay? And I'm basically just going to use that and braid it in. So the left strand over and the right strand over. And you don't have to pay any attention to if the hair is on top or if it's underneath. You're just gonna braid it straight down and there you've got your finished look. Okay. 